In a classic 50 Cent move, the rapper has once again trolled his longtime rival, Sean Diddy Combs, following the news of Diddy's arrest and the bizarre details that have come to light. As the hip hop world reels from Diddy's arrest on charges of racketeering and sex trafficking, it's the discovery of over 1,000 bottles of lubricant in his homes that has everyone talking. And, as usual, 50 Cent wasted no time taking shots at the embattled music mogul, reigniting their infamous feud in a very public, very savage way. The world of hip-hop has always been ripe with rivalries, but few have been as enduring and entertaining as the one between 50 Cent and Sean Diddy Combs. The two have been trading barbs for years, but their latest public spat may just take the cake. After Diddy was arrested on charges that sent shockwaves through the music industry, including racketeering and sex trafficking, the internet was abuzz. But it wasn't just the severity of the charges that grabbed attention, it was the peculiar items seized during the federal raids on Diddy's homes that became the real talking point. Authorities reportedly found more than 1,000 bottles of baby oil and lubricant, sparking a wave of memes and ridicule across social media. Never one to miss an opportunity to clown on his rival, 50 Cent took to Instagram and X to mock Diddy, continuing their long-standing feud with a combination of humor and savage takedowns. The feud between 50 Cent and Diddy has been simmering for years, with both rappers often throwing jabs at one another through social media and interviews. However, Diddy's recent arrest and the ensuing media circus surrounding the federal raids on his properties have given 50 Cent ample material to work with. On Tuesday, 50 Cent shared a photo of himself alongside actress Drew Barrymore, taken from his appearance on The Drew Barrymore Show, with a caption that managed to jab at Diddy's latest legal troubles. Here I am keeping good company with that Drew Barrymore TV, he wrote, before cheekily adding, and I don't have 1,000 bottles of lube at the house. This was far from a one-off. The rapper, known for his sharp wit and no-holds-barred approach to online trolling, also took aim at Diddy's deeper legal issues. The charges against Diddy, which include allegations of sex trafficking and racketeering, have led to a renewed scrutiny of his past behavior, particularly after his ex-girlfriend Cassie filed a lawsuit in late 2023 accusing him of rape and abuse. Though the case was settled quickly, more allegations have surfaced, with at least seven other individuals leveling similar accusations. And in true 50 Cent fashion, he didn't hold back, sarcastically posting about Diddy's innocence with a scathing undertone. Alongside resurfaced footage of Diddy allegedly assaulting Cassie in 2016, 50 Cent wrote, Now I'm sure Puffy didn't do it, he is innocent this proves nothing. This is what his lawyers are gonna say, God help us all. The arrest, which occurred at the Park Hyatt Hotel in New York City, led to Diddy being charged with three major counts, racketeering conspiracy, sex trafficking by force, fraud or coercion, and transportation for prostitution. The 14-page indictment details decades of abuse, coercion, and threats allegedly carried out by Diddy and his associates to protect his reputation and conceal his conduct. Among the more shocking details, in addition to the vast lube collection, were reports of firearms and ammunition found at Diddy's properties, including three AR-15s with defaced serial numbers. These weapons, according to prosecutors, were allegedly used to intimidate and silence witnesses and victims of Diddy's abuse. As expected, Diddy's legal team was quick to issue a statement, labeling the arrest an example of unjust prosecution. Mark Agnifilo, Diddy's lawyer, admitted that while his client is imperfect, he maintained that Diddy had done nothing against the law. Please reserve your judgment until you have all the facts, Agnifilo pleaded, adding that his client looks forward to clearing his name in court. Despite this, 50 Cent has already made up his mind, leading his followers to revel in the latest chapter of their public sparring. In the midst of Diddy's escalating legal battles, 50 Cent took his trolling to the next level by announcing his intention to produce a documentary about the scandal, which he's tentatively titled, Diddy Do It? The documentary, if produced, would likely delve into Diddy's criminal charges and the many allegations surrounding him. Given 50's previous ventures into film and television with successful shows like Power, it's clear he's no stranger to producing gripping content. Fans and critics alike are already buzzing at the prospect, as 50 Cent's blend of humor and incisive commentary could make for a captivating watch.
as Sean D. Combs faces what could be the most serious legal battle of his life, 50 Cent's trolling game remains as strong as ever. Their feud, which has been one of the most memorable in hip-hop history, continues to evolve with every new controversy. While Diddy fights to clear his name, 50 Cent has positioned himself as a vocal and humorous critic, adding fuel to the fire with each post and comment. Whether it's through social media banter or a potential documentary, 50 Cent has made it clear that when it comes to his longtime nemesis, he's not letting up any time soon. In the ever-dramatic world of celebrity rivalries, this one is far from over, especially with 50 Cent at the helm, stirring the pot with every opportunity.